Hi, I'm Peter Dinsdale, President and CEO of YMCA Canada. I'm speaking with you today to share how this pandemic is impacting YMCA's and charities more broadly. The YMCA has been a part of communities for decades. We've been a place of connection and belonging in times of fortune and celebration. And we've been there in times of recessions, depressions, and disasters helping communities recover. COVID-19 has been no different. From coast to coast, YMCA's have steadfastly continued to provide services to ensure communities have access to the support they need during the crisis, either by moving them online or opening their doors wherever possible. We're transforming facilities to protect the homeless and providing childcare for our essential service workers. Our employment and immigration settlement services are being delivered by phone and online. We've also launched virtual workshops to promote physical and mental wellness. YMCA's are responding to the urgent needs of communities, but not in absence of significant challenges as a result of the closures and a decline in funds. We thank the Government of Canada for recognizing the needs of the charitable sector. The Canada Emergency Wage Subsidy has meant that YMCA's can retain and recall staff previously laid off and ensure they remain connected to the Y. And the $315 million Emergency Support Fund will help charities continue to provide emergency services to vulnerable populations today. While these announcements are a large step forward, a large financial gap continues to exist in absence of core stabilization support for the sector. That's why YMCA Canada supports Imagine Canada's call for broader sector stabilization to address this financial shortfall. Sector stabilization will ensure that charities continue to provide the programs communities rely on and that our buildings will remain open once we can come together again. For the YMCA, this means continuing to reach over 2.28 million people through 1,700 locations across Canada today, and even more tomorrow. So let's continue to help each other, and we'll get through this together. Thank you.